I'm here with Adam Preston at SharePoint Saturday Richmond. And Adam, what's the one thing that people need to know about SharePoint 2010? The, the one thing that I think uh, most people should know about SharePoint 2010 is the uh, ability to use PowerShell. Now, now, I am by no means a developer. I do not call myself a developer. So um, initially, I was very scared of PowerShell and what it could do. I didn't know anything about it, object model, none of that. So uh, I was intimidated by it. But once I actually started learning about it and learning about the commandlets and how easy it is and with the verb, noun, interface, being able to do like get, SP site, get sites, uh, et cetera, I was able to learn it uh, step by step and see the value that I could do with uh, PowerShell in terms of um, generating lists of site owners and permissions, uh, being able to add web parts to 500 uh, pages within four seconds. Uh, to me, that's when the light bulb said, went off and said, hey, this is powerful, I need, to, I need to know this more. Now, to this day, I'm still not a developer, but through, through the increased, uh, increased uh, experiences I've gained through PowerShell, it has um, given me the opportunities to significantly, significantly uh, increase the capabilities that I can do with an administrator uh, SharePoint 2010. So for somebody who's just starting out, where would you have them start if they want to find out more? Anything you could recommend? Yeah, there's uh, great uh, PowerShell books um, by Gary LaPointe and uh, Sh uh, Shannon Bray, who are pretty much the two leaders in SharePoint uh, PowerShell. Um, also, um, Microsoft actually does have a great uh, TechNet uh, area for PowerShell. And uh, also, if you go to SharePoint 2010 Learn, uh, SharePoint 20, Microsoft has a Learn site. And there's great uh, Get Started videos for SharePoint 2010 administrators.